Good detectives. <laughs> You've imprisoned him against his will. I know he didn't want to be left in there. And you have locked the gates on him, that's false imprisonment. Well okay. guys, scout soldiers at the headquarters in Cheshire. Um, it's, um, I was quite surprised, like, what it was like. Um, yeah. Bit of a mad building, like. I wasn't expecting it to be this big, but it's, it is, it's big. Can you take side the security guard? Hi man up guys, look. See him? Hey, he's following me. He's like, follow the lads with the mask. Yeah. I'm fine, yourself? Yes, thank you, I'll carry. Just normal day. Okay, you're on private land. Yeah, and uh, it might be private land, mate, but it's publicly accessible under Section 33, the Criminal Justice Act 1972, and it's a civil matter, so the police have no jurisdiction over okay. that. Thank you. No problem. Um, you're yeah. on private land. Okay. Now, if you just listen to me a minute, this chap's trying to close the gates to headquarters. Okay. As is his link, because it's a private building and okay. it's private land. Right, so are you going to use poor then? Pardon? You're going to use poor. You're a police officer. You should know what yeah, poor yeah, is. No, I'm having a conversation. We're going to explain it. Okay, yeah. Um, we are trying to close the building. Obviously, we can't because you're on our private land. So okay. I'm asking you to leave now. Uh, what I am going to tell you as well is that I've now been called down to come and speak to you. Yeah, that's fine. That's, so that's obstructed me from doing what I'm doing. So under Section 68 of the Criminal Justice and Public Order Act, yep. you're now committing the offence of aggravated trespass. Well, I'm not, I'm not preventing you from doing so I'm anything. I'm you, talking to you. You are. But you've just said I'm talking to you, so I'm yeah. still studying, okay. speaking to you. So I'm not... Okay, I'm in that case, can I'm ask talking your name? to you. Sorry. Can I ask your name? No, I don't really need to give it. Okay, no, I didn't say yeah. you did. I asked your name because when I have a conversation with someone, normally you try and use names. Yeah, no, I, I, under, I understand that, um, okay. as, as I said, but I just want to get back to obstructing you. I'm not, you've asked me to stop to have a conversation with you, so if anything, you're okay, causing okay. the obstruction, okay, not that's me. Fine. Um, my colleague's trying to lock headquarters. Yeah, no, he, he's been fantastic. Yeah, 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 he has, he's been yeah, fantastic. Very good. Very good. Um, he can't lock headquarters while we've got people on the ground who shouldn't be on here. Okay. Uh, you two. So I'm now asking you to leave. Okay. okay. So we understand are you prepared that. to leave? Yeah, we, we're prepared okay, to leave. Okay, let's go then. All right, that's cool. You Thank have, you. You have to follow us. No, no, I do have to follow you because you're on private land at the police station. Okay, yeah. then step back, Tom. Ah, sorry, excuse me, you've approached me. I'm, I'm asking you to leave. Towards me. I've got it on video. Right, you're now obstructing me doing I'm my not. job. I'll just we were just having a nice friendly conversation. There's no need for you to mean it. Section 68 of the Public Order, Criminal Justice Act. Yeah. I want you to leave now or you're going to be able to... You're just... leaving. What's yeah. wrong with walking backwards? Well, you're going to trip over. Don't well, you I don't know yourself. what you're going to do. You Sorry, might trip me over. So I've asked you to leave. I am leaving. I've pointed out the offence. You're on private land. I've done nothing wrong. I'm not saying you have. Done nothing wrong. Well, Section you have. You've committed aggravated trespass. The Criminal Justice Act gives us access through the gates. Okay. You know this. We've and you've now been wrong. told that you're now committing aggravated trespass. But we're still, we're still walking. Okay, we've we've right. agreed to what you've said. Can I ask you something? I just yeah. don't want to turn it's Saturday night. Have you not got like a beer to go and drink or yeah, go and get pizza or something? Saturday night wearing fake tan. There's got to be something better than doing this. And I wish it was fake tan. So something better. It's actually it's actually a really good job. Yeah, right. It pays very well. What does? It pays very well. What does? This? Playing videos on YouTube? It's not on YouTube. Is it not? Yeah, sorry oh, to guess your bubble. No YouTube it? fame? No, I don't use YouTube. What do you use? It's a special platform just for us. Are you the ones who've been to Nantwich as well, or is that different to you? Nantwich? No, not you tonight then. Eh, yeah, I don't know. Well, it's been explained to you, I haven't it? asked what him yourself how long he spoke guys, to me Guys, listen, you've had, you've had your interaction. You haven't spoke to yeah, me. Yeah, it's hard to do with that. It's, you know, we're not, we're, 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 we're leaving. Asking, what do you want us to do, run? You've interaction, you've got your video. I'm asking you to leave now, guys. And we are leaving. Right. We're just walking as normal faces as you. We keep saying yes, we're going. Okay, yeah. but you're, you're walking, walking backwards back. and I'm really worried you're going to trip over something. I'm worried no. you're going to trip me over. Okay, well, no one's going to trip you over, are they? Well, I'm worried you're going to trip me over. You keep calling me. Guys, what I would say to the two of you is... Oh, you're the chief inspector? I'm the superintendent. Superintendent, yeah, sorry. Yeah. Well, can I have your number as well since you've made contact with me? You want my number? Yeah, yeah please. 4596. Thank you, name? Superintendent Evans. All right, thank you. Superintendent Chester. Thank you. Okay. You sound like I'm going to give you your details. 
I'm not obliged to, unfortunately. Get away from me now. Whoa, what are you doing pushing me? Oh, you're a bad man, aren't you? Move. I don't care, I really don't care. You just assaulted me here, people. It's classed as unwanted contact. We are moving. Very aggressive, you. Very aggressive. Well, I don't like you walking up right behind me. I didn't walk behind you. Yes, you did. Okay. Listen, he's, he's a firearms officer with a weapon on his he's not going to... But he's clearly got mental health issues. Look at the way he's looking at me and you've got a firearm. Why? Do you want us to be scared because you're a firearms officer? Yeah. That's a one-stop touch-up over a curve of night because you're worried about falling down. Come on, you're bullying us. Listen, Pigger, you're bullying us. Don't call me Pigger, mate. Well, that's what you are. You're bullying us. One more. Guys, it's okay. Off you go. For what? For what? I haven't done anything. So the camera doesn't lie, mate. It's live. Very aggressive firearms officer. He's already put hands on me, which is classed as unwanted contact, people. This is what the public are paying for to be abused by a firearms officer. This is how your taxpayers' money is spent with aggression. Don't touch yes. the pod, mate, walking backwards. Okay, I'm fine. It's all right, Steve. Stop approaching me. It's all right. I'm happy the way it is. Well, you're walking towards the gate. Yeah, I, don't I know. Want to hurt yourself. I'm not going to hurt myself, mate. Is this guy's bully tactics? There's a road behind you. I, I know he is. All right, uh, I'm, there'll be cars on the road. I'm perfectly capable okay. of looking after myself. Well, there'll be cars on the road. Stay okay. Have a good evening. Bye bye. Okay. Yeah. Go on then, come back. Gents, if you step foot back on premises, yeah. I will arrest you both. You you arrest arrest us both. You've already yeah. assaulted yeah. me, okay. so Don't let's get that right. clear. You enjoy your me. Saturday night. You enjoy yeah. yourself. Do you know about, yeah. hey. Please do, please do. We will do. Go on then, take time. Yep. Bye bye. See ya. See you, scum. You are going to professional standards, you though, because at the end of the day, you assaulted me. Have you got, have you got the contact details for our professional standards department? No. Oh, oh, well, I've already got a source within professional you standards. Yeah, I've got a good source. Give me the details at all. No, but this source does the job correctly and does hold you accountable. I was going to give you co uh, contact what? details from that all. Michael okay. Evans, yeah, yeah, I've superintendent of whatever LBC made against. Well, Mark him, Roberts, guys, you. he okay. is a tyrant. I'll let Mr. Roberts he know. He abuses a there. member of the public. Okay, okay, Firearms guys. officer. Have a great evening. Very, very abusive man, this Have one. Have a great evening, boys. I think he's got mental issues and should not be. Wait, wait, you got to laugh. you got to laugh. Just leave him to it. Go on, then. See you, boys. Bye-bye. See ya. Sure Come on, these boots are made for walking. <laughs> and that's just what they'll do. People, they've locked the man bun in there. <laughs> <laughs> they've locked the man bun in there. They have no idea. <laughs> oh, dear God. His butt's hurting. Hey, don't be you. Um, don't apply for a job for CID anytime soon, boys. You'd be terrible at it. Couldn't investigate a <laughs> You couldn't investigate a fanny in an orhouse. <laughs> Oh. I'm gonna. I just want to say this for the record. You are a disgrace for a superintendent. Okay. I tell you that. I've met a lot professional than you. Okay. Honest. That's you, great. You, you, your respect for the public zero. Mate. Yeah, it is zero. Okay. And that, you know. You're just an horrible scumbag. Guys, the way I, you touched me. Two, I, I, I three did. Times, oh, 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 oh. Unwanted Excuse contact. Me. You're filming that. You can have a look. I didn't touch you. Didn't yeah, you touch did. you at any you point. Did. You, okay. Did. Okay. you did. You did. You did. It's on camera. Okay. I've got it. Do you know what I mean? And you know. That wasn't you, me. That was him, and you never. You and him. You okay. both did it. One each guys, time. Guys, guys. It's all right. It's all right, Mark Evans. It's Mike, okay. Mike, we, come on, Mike. Mark to me, you're going to be called Mark. Mike. M I K H. No, no, it's Mark it's today. Mark. We okay. give our own names. You see. It's Mark, okay. short for Skid Mark. <laughs> okay. You know you can't. Yeah, so we're going to write to Mark Roberts about these Copperfield Michael Jackson fans over here. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody, yes, little did they realise the man bun's still in there. Oh, this is crazy. Yeah, as I say, I've just been assaulted anyway by a firearms officer. Bully boy tactics. And uh, this disgrace here. Yeah. Tried to um, he asked me to stop to talk and then tried to tell me I was committing an offence. 
so he's trying to then trap me into a criminal offence and this is how the police conduct their business nowadays so yeah it's a good job we've got a good legal team to deal with these people He's laughing now, <laughs> but wait till we put his privacy complaints in. Selling you. Yeah. Gentlemen, he's alright. He's a good honest. Oh, he actually was more professional than you. Okay. And near the end of the SIA badge. Well, well, guys, as you know, we're in a. No, you're not even a nice man. You know you're there. I'll see you before about a I was talking to a friend or whatever. Well, I couldn't hear that, could I? Am I in? Right. And you just charged towards me aggressively and you kept touching and putting your hand No, no one was aggressive to you. Yeah, you were. Yeah, it was. The threat level and you're walking around with a camera with something attached to it that wow. looks like it could be a dead mouse, but I'm not quite sure what it is. No, it's a gun. I, I, don't, I don't know what it is, but you you'd, you'd be saying it's a dead man switch next. Nah, well, you've got a bag on you. You don't know who you are. You're not prepared to give me your details, you've got your faces covered guys, so well, we've got bags. a heightened threat level. Okay, well, well we've got a heightened threat level, you know, and you're not prepared get. to give you details. Well, no, no, but we've got to stick to what we're legally obliged to do. Okay. Well, and as we... I know, but we have public access. Yeah. Okay, and now you haven't, that's fine. And, and I noticed how you waited for your boyfriend before you beat your I know. You were all, you're all nice as pie, and then you, you watch two firearms officers come, and then you thought you'd grow a set. Yeah, it's all on camera. And, but he's, your, your colleague assaulted me, okay. and he, he was looking at me and as I've if he offered, wanted to kill me. And I've offered you the details for our press as well. You're a superintendent. No, I want his details, I want his name and number. Okay. You're a superintendent. You, you're two, okay. You're, you're, you're a superintendent. Mm -hmm. What about your policing policy? Or is it not the winner? <laughs> Yeah, I mean, you have policing policies, don't you? The 10 policing policies, we Robert Peel. Principles. So, sorry, yeah, principles, yeah. my mistake. Yeah. So why can't you just address it correctly then and rather be that rude? I, you asked towards me, you was very rude. I asked your colleague how he wanted to be addressed. Yeah, but I wasn't there. Well, I mean, that's was not my fault, need? you missed the conversation. I'm just and saying, you're calling me nosy and you're the one pointing the camera at me. Was there any need in the way you threatened me? I didn't threaten you and I was speaking to your colleague. It's all on video, would you think I've threatened you? Watch it, guys. Yeah, but, I mean, come on, there's no need for that. Guys. You went on a bit horrible about it. That's fine, but you're not getting a bite tonight, so... I don't want to buy. Okay. Don't it's, want it's, buy. It's not about that. Okay. That's not, that's not, that's it's not about, the core. Okay. It's about exposing okay. a behaviour like yours. Okay. Because it's not what we want to pay for. Okay. I agree with you. I agree. It's an absolute waste of time and money having to have three cops dealing with people who are on private land. Not so really. I agree with you. The security man said we could go around. Your sign said it on the gate. What are you doing? You, you're about? security officer. You're manufacturing around. something. Your sign says you can go around. Yeah, it says when the gate's shut, the public can't enter. So yeah, which so means. Your sign says you can go around. So which means we can enter, yes or no? See that one in blue that says all visitors must report to reception? Well, we did. We did go to reception, but unfortunately it was closed, so we can't report. You just jump in the Otherwise, door. we would have followed the guidelines of the signage. Guys, as soon as the gates are shut, I'll be on my way. Respect goes both right. ways. It's simple as that. I, I agree completely. But agree you showed completely. me nothing. Okay. You showed me nothing, you okay. disrespected that's me. That's your perception. I'm a member of the public. Okay. Alright, and fair enough, that's how you want to be. You just properly got your head up your own arse, man. Why okay. can't you just say, look, man, I was a You're ruining it for the good ones. I ruined it for the good ones. You know what I mean? You just give yourself a bad name. And you wonder why there's a. to be as reasonable as I can and be polite with you, mate. I have done from the start. Okay. And you've just been a bit rude and okay. arrogant and sarcastic and cocky, and there's no okay. need for it. It makes that's you look fine. silly, especially for your ranking. Okay. Think about it, your insignia as a superintendent. Yeah. You know, it's not good for PR, is it? Okay. Honest. Okay. And listen, I, Mark Roberts would be ashamed I, of you. I am not going to worry about the kind of people who are watching. Well, it's, well, it's to be the members of the public. Why aren't you bothered? Oh, uh, Zach, that's what I thought. Run away onto your phone. I'm not going anywhere, am I? You know, I thought you was going anyway. I am when they lock the gates. I said that to you. As soon as they oh, lock the gates, locked? I'll be on my way now. Oh, you want the keys? <laughs> oh, God. Can I just ask you, you're an intelligent man. Is the intelligent people that work here? I hope Alex only me, you're all right. Because it doesn't look like there is. Can you get all the security and ask them to lock these gates? I've shut them, but they're not locked. And um, the ARV is still looking for this uh, individual. Oh, it's right, they're on the way back. <laughs> Yeah, we've got, we've got the third one now, mate, so um, I'm just going to get a security. Good detectives. <laughs> <laughs> We're trying to three and Alpha team. You've imprisoned him against his will. I know, he didn't want to be left in there. Oh, 
and you've locked the gates on them. That's false imprisonment. Okay. Gates aren't locked. Point out to you, the gates aren't locked. Told you the gates aren't locked. Hey, you locked. you might have learning difficulties, though. You might not be able to use the gates. Well, free our friend. Open the gate. Yeah, free him. Open the gate. Free we kidnapped him. Superintendent, come on. I will open the gate. Can you just tell us your numbers, then? Here's the man bun here. Yeah. So Coming. Yeah. They kidnapped him. Nine, they held him against his will. Can you get your colleague's same number, please? Because he's uh, made contact with me. This security chap is signed. Yeah, nice fella, this security chap. Oh, come on. Oh, you see that? He's just assaulted him with a gate. What a piece of shit you are. You've just assaulted him. I'm asking you as a member of the public, mate. You scumbag. You are a scumbag piece of shit. You've just hit him with the gate. It's a public place, mate. Okay. Yeah. Little piggy, eh? Can you get your colleague? I want your colleague's details because he assaulted me and I want to make a formal complaint. There's no need for that, mate. And you've just assaulted me friend with you've just witnessed and I've got it on camera. I want no, I want his details because he assaulted me, not you. I want his name and number. Name and number. I'm gonna tell you now, I've told him, if you swear again, you're gonna be arrested under section five of the public order act. Yes, you have, and I've seized that and we'll watch that and we'll see if you swore. Okay, mate. You don't need the public You can't seize it without a court order. You can't be offended. A you person's a, guilty of section lie, 5 public order if they use threatening or insulting words or behaviour, disorderly behaviour, or displays any rank In a public place with members, members that is likely to shouldn't have been. Why do you think we're aggravated? Because you've just assaulted a member of the public knowingly and willingly. I didn't swear, I've asked you not to swear. I didn't swear. I want you to be charged with complaint. Yeah, for assaulting me. Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to assault you. 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 Yeah, you got to give the goods with the bad guys. Yeah, so we, that guy's been amazing and this guy's been amazing. Thank you. ta -ra, mate. Get the good side, yeah? Yeah, yeah. Oh. Well, guys, he's just assaulted the man bun. And he assaulted me as well. Absolute disgraces. Did they say that to you as well? If you come back, you'll be arrested for aggravated trespass. At least you've done the walk of shame.